Oscars week is here, and while films like Oppenheimer, Barbie, American Fiction, and Maestro are generating buzz ahead of this year's 96th Academy Awards, first, engineers are taking center stage for their contributions to the craft of cinematic storytelling. We're here on the red carpet where engineers are getting their moment in the spotlight at the Academy's SciTech Awards, also known as the Technical Oscars. Welcome to the Circuit News. From groundbreaking visual effects to revolutionary sound systems and graphic designs, this week we're diving into all the ways engineers play a pivotal role in shaping our movie-going experience. These technologies have enabled filmmakers to shoot in ways never before possible, safely create awe-inspiring special effects, exquisitely design and share digital creations, and dramatically level up the cinematic experience. Over at Pixar, engineers have made it easy for any filmmaker to create the animations you see in films like Toy Story 4. It's called the Universal Scene Description, or OpenUSD. The open source software platform allows anyone to collaborate and construct animated 3D scenes, unlocking a new realm of creativity. There are many other talented engineers and artists at other studios that have made contributions in the open source to um, add new features, fix bugs, and uh, so it's been all together um, a, a really rich collaboration. Sebastian Gracia is one of the Pixar engineers who designed and deployed OpenUSD. His Pixar team won an engineering award at this year's Technical Oscars. OpenUSD is recognized by the Academy for how it's become an industry standard, not only in the visual effects community, but also in architecture, robotics, and manufacturing, to name a few. It's been really, um, kind of amazing how it's really taken off in other industries. Mesmerizing special effects like smoke, fire, and explosions that happen in some of your favorite hit films and TV shows were all created by OpenVDB. I mean, every movie these days, just if it has visual effects in it, it's probably got some use of VDB at, at some level. I mean, it's so ubiquitous in how it's how it's used these days. Open VDB is an open source tool instrumental in creating mesmerizing effects while allowing special effects teams to efficiently store what previously would have been very large data files. It's another problem solved by computer science engineers. I would feel very lucky to be recognized for all the work. But it's not just about the technology. It's also about how engineers collaborate with filmmakers to bring their visions to life. Take director Christopher Nolan's masterpiece Oppenheimer. Clocking in at over three hours, this movie pushed the boundaries of storytelling. Entirely shot on film, engineers at Kodak developed a new 65 millimeter black and white format, capturing the raw intensity of historic moments like the Trinity test. We were able to test large format black and white, put it up on a giant IMAX screen and have a look at it, and, and the results were just magical. I don't think Chris would be capable of doing something kind of the way everyone else does it. He kind of invented this idea of shooting an IMAX for feature film, and so you're kind of on the cutting edge of this stuff every time you work with him. And speaking of IMAX, their team was also recognized at the SciTech Awards for their prismless laser projector. And we did this free space light engine. Most laser projections use a prism that merged the red, blue, and green lights to create a full color image that projects onto the screen. But engineers at IMAX were able to create prismless laser projection that makes the big screen brighter with unbelievable color contrast. So what ideas will engineers come up with next to revolutionize the movie going experience? The possibilities are endless. That's all the time we have this week. If you enjoyed this video, like and follow us for more engineering news at Circuit News TV.